Hey guys, this is Mr. Crayfish and welcome back. Today we're going to be taking a look at a mod that I developed during a stream and this is Cray Tokens. So Cray Tokens is a simple currency mod which you can use on a server and there are four types of tokens in this. So the lowest tier of token is a copper token, the next one up is a silver, then we have gold and then the highest tier is a platinum token. Now each one is 64 of the next tier, so 64 copper equals one silver token, 64 silver tokens equals one gold token, 64 gold tokens equals one platinum token. So if we open up this chest here and I stick, or if I get all these out and I um, just I actually put them into my hotbar, so when you have 64 copper token, what you do is you right click it and you'll get one silver token and then you can just add that to like a stack you might have. Um, once you've got 64 silver token, if you right click that you'll get a gold. If you right click when you have 64 gold tokens in your hand, you'll get a platinum token. Now this can be done vice versa using a crafting table. So if you put the platinum token in, token in you get 64 gold back. If you put the gold one in, you get 64 silver tokens back, and then if you put the silver in, you'll get 64 copper tokens back. So you might be asking yourself, how do I obtain these tokens? And the answer to that is to kill mobs. So I've got some volunteers over here. They all signed up for this video. Uh, so we'll go ahead and kill the zombie here. And as you can see, he dropped a lovely copper token. If we kill the skeleton, He'll drop another token, and if we kill the creeper, he'll drop a token too. Now, this can be done to any hostile mob. Um, friendly mobs don't drop coins. Now, there is a rare chance that you'll either get a silver, a gold, or a platinum token from a mob, but they are very rare. A platinum one is 1 in 2,000, so that's really high. Um, a gold one is 1 in 500, and then a silver one is 1 in 100. So they're quite rare to get um, the next tiers up. If we head down this direction, I just want to show you some examples that I've made using this currency. So if you're on some sort of SMP server and you want to implement some sort of shop, um, I've set up these shops here to work with the, um, the tokens. So here it says insert one token and we'll get one um, chest, so one silver token I mean. Uh, so we'll put that in. And there we go, we have a chest. Now on this one we've got insert one platinum token and we'll get an enchantment table. Awesome. Now just a little side note, I'm going to do a tutorial on these very simple trading machines. So if you were wanting to know how, um, there will be a tutorial out soon, so make sure you subscribe. But anyway, the next thing that I want to take a look at is um, the computer here from my furniture mod. So I've added a hook in, so instead of using gems, it actually uses the Cray token. So if we go ahead and open up the computer, we'll sit down, we need to be comfy. If we go, op go ahead and open up the computer, um, if this mod is installed, it will actually use the tokens instead of the emeralds. And why is that really offset? That's really weird. I'll have to fix that up later. Um, so yeah, it uses the tokens instead, it uses the silver ones. I thought gold would have been a little bit too hard to get. But yeah, as you can see, you can buy like everything from a mod using these tokens. So we'll go ahead and we'll buy a lovely oven from here. Give me the oven. <laughs> Give us our tokens back. And we'll place that down there. Yay. Now one thing I really wanted to implement was an API, so if you are a modder, you can use this API to access the token items from this mod and implement them in some way into your mod. So for instance, you might have like a shop block or something like that, and you want um, some sort of currency, you can use this API and use the my currency, the Cray tokens, as your payment instead of using like Minecraft's emeralds or something like that. Um, there are many possibilities what you could do with this, it's practically endless. So if you want the API, the download link will be in the forum post. So if you want to download this mod and add it to your server, the forum post link will be in the description where from there you can download the mod. If you are a modder and you're considering adding 
this API to your mod, um, let me know because I will add your mod forum post link into my forum post um, just so people know which mods actually support this Cray tokens. So that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to leave a like and I will see you guys next time. Bye bye.